Boom kick. Rising thing. And Ace Adams breaks it up again. And, and Blisterin takes out Ace Adams. Shoulder, shoulder tackled by Price. This locking in the submission. We're up to the 20 minute mark now in this matchup. Flip pile driver. And now Glycerin's been busted open. This has been a brutal tag team match. on the floor. And, oh, Yurinagi slam by Ace Adams. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, this has been a, a brutal tag team up and I'm nice against. What, what the heck just happened there? Dragon suplex with the bridge. The kick out. Look at this. The 
blackout by Ace Adams. It looks like he may be setting him up for something here. Front slam. And Ace Adams. Split leg moonsault. And now he's going to the top himself. He's waiting very patiently. I don't know what for. Oh, went for the splash, but Wuga got the knees up. Swing and neck breaker by Wuga Booga. And ref, will you turn around? Oh my goodness, you, you bossed it, Pablo Dow, explosive the victory right there. On ball. Play both high. Double kaboom kick. But Andy and, and Primal Dial Explosion continuing to punish Ace Adams here. Adams is trying to do here. 6.30 centon. There's a cover. And, and a kick out by Wuga. Now into the triangle choke again. And Wuga getting out of it once more. Reverse DDT. Fire slip into the corner. Running splash by Luga. And there's that neck breaker again. Makes a tag to Nick Nitro Glycerin. Perhaps Luga was getting a little fatigued. Shoulder tackle by Ace Adams. Now, oh no. Going for the superplex to the floor.
Ladies and gentlemen, we are now up to the 29 and a half minutes. Oh, butterfly pile driver. Brings him all the way to his own corner. Will this be it? Will it finally be it? No! Now up to 30 minutes. This match has gone by. Submission applied. But too close to the ropes. Oh man, what's it gonna do? What's it gonna take? Fireman's, fireman's carry into a cutter. Oh. This it. Yes, it finally. My gosh. After over 30 minutes of living hell, Primordial Explosion gets the job done. My gosh. That was a tag team match for the ages. The winners of the match of 30 minutes and 39 seconds. Prime or Dial Explosion. Now all these men could go back could go to the back and get stitched. All right, here we go. Coming down to the ring. Paul Utaker and Mr. Utaker. Heaven and Hell.
Former Commonwealth Tag Team Champions as well. Looking to get back to the top here in the Tag Team Division. <laughs> Frozen Rage, how's it going, buddy? You thought Mr. U had an afro there? No, 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 no. I know, it can be confusing, but trust me, it's not an afro. And coming down to the ring, the team of Ryan Osborne and Chris Cage. match will meet primordial explosion in the semi-finals hopefully it's not another 30 minute match and here we go oh paul you take her with a hurricane rana there's one way to start the match off Ooh. Just drops him down and oh look at this. Cartwheel moonsault. <clears throat> now look at this. Into a bit of a dragon sleeper, but too close to the ropes. Now has him up in the fireman's carry. And drops him on the top rope. Paul Hutaker nearly just took, took the bottom rope with him. Irish room to the corner. And the tag is made. And uh-oh. Going for the fall of man here. And there it is. Oh, slip of the leg. Chris Cage. And now hammers away on the face of Mr. Utaker. Going for it again. And on the last call, you take, I don't know what's going on with him. Submission applied by Chris Cage. Now, me, Mr. Utaker. Has Chris Cage in hand, but Chris Cage elbows to the midsection and gets out of that predicament. Oh, look at this now. Oh, look at this. Oh, wow. Nice neck breaker there. But oh, look at this. He's got a claw on him now. Chris Cage gets out of that one.
Oh, Chris Cage. Oh, I'm just sucking. And, you know, speaking of the U-Takers, we have yet to hear from Mrs. U-Taker after she was attacked by the debuting Katrina Havoc. Hopefully we can get a word from her. Oh, the gates of hell have just swung open. And oh, almost got a quick one there. And now Mr. U-Taker calling his creatures of the night to give him strength. Foot in the grave. something here. I'm not sure what it is. Oh, look at this. And snake eyes. And once again, we got blood in this one. Just about everybody's been busted open, apparently. And now, Ryan Osborne. Comes in off the tag, takes him down with a forearm. There's a clothesline and a jumping clothesline. Oh, look at this, look at this. Oh, the weight of Mr. U Taker was just too much for Ryan Osborne there. Claw again, just smushing the face of Osborne. And Osborne, just like this cage, gets out of the predicament. And falls lying into the corner. And look at this, Irish went into the corner now. And reversal. Another Irish whip. Tag made, and here comes Chris Cage. And the rocket launcher. Oh, oh my goodness, Mr. You take it just sat up. Oh, got taken down though, immediately by a spear. Oh, look at this. Reverse DDT. You take her into the cover. Uh, I know Chris Cage kicked out. And, oh, look at Paul. You take her. Rolling cutter. And for Mr. You take her. Dropped right on his head and neck. And the cover. Oh, breaks it up immediately. That claw again. And Chris Cage was busted open, so that that's gotta make the pain even worse. And Mr. Utaker makes the tag to his son Paul. And Paul Utaker going to the top rope. I don't know how wise this is. This is the elbow. Oh boy. Oh. Power bomb and elbow combination. face of Paul Utaker. Looks like he's trying to bust him well. He 
strike and neck breaker. Well, the CC got it. And all you take it kicks out. I was limited to the corner now. And the tag is made. Oh, look at this. Neck break bomb. It, it is a cover. Kick out at two. Taker throws Ryan Osborne into his own corner and connects with a spinning back kick and another one. Knee dropped there by Osborne. Going for the neck break bomb again. And got him. So this now to a pinning combination. And oh, almost had him there. That hand was just coming down for three. Close line. And drops it down with another. And there's a cat kick. And drops him on his head and neck. Oh, this day sent him up. And there it is. And now going for the CC again. And the, this time, Paul Utaker saw it coming. Tag is made. Funny splash in the corner. Now look at this. And oh, close line. Oh, step up at Jaguri. Heaven and hell putting the boots to Ryan stomping a mutt hold on him and walking in dry. And drop kick to the ribs. Kick out. Oh, Goranagi slam by Mr. Utaker. Osborne counters with a back body drop. Oh, wow. Spinning side slam. Shade to the late Mr. Perfect. Drops the 
elbow. And there's that knee strike. That breaker combo again. Oh, Mr. Utaker back up on his feet. Uh-oh. He's going for the Hell's Gate Tombstone. Will this be it? But oh, one just just breaks it up. Oh, I don't think there's gonna be any saving for him this time. Oh wow! Oh wait, watch the foot! Watch the foot! Too close to the ropes. Now, Mr. Utaker stomping away on the joints of Chris Cage. And one to the head for good measure. Tended to bust Mr. U Taker open as well. Tag is made. And going and going for that neck break bomb again. There was a down. And Paul U Taker breaks it up. Oh! Utaker. Brad caught him with a kick. And oh, over the top to the outside. Slam. This is one of where his son is. Back body drop. That could cost him here. Uh, side slam. Into the cover. Goodness. Well, ladies and gentlemen, another fantastic matchup. But with that being said, the finals, oh, sorry, the semifinals are now set. As we take a look at the highlights of this match. There's that neck break bomb that almost got Paul Utaker. Your winners of the match at 16 minutes and 52 seconds, Ryan Osborne and Chris Cage. Gentlemen, we are now moving on to the semifinals. Yep. The team of Excalibur takes on the Forgotten Billion Boys.
Ladies and gentlemen, who do you have? Place your bets. Who's going to the finals? Excalibur coming down to the ring in the semi-final contest. They defeated Victor Goldman in the Bastage in the first round to get here. I'll tell you what, they're going to they're going up against a, a team that's been pretty impressive as of late. Mike Blood and Lex Storm of the Forgotten Billion Boys. So far, they've defeated the tag champs last week as well at the same time. Earlier today, knocking off Jake Bagwell and Jason Danger. So far, they're undefeated as a tag team here. And it's going to be Mark Caliber and Lex Storm starting things off. tie up into the quarter now and the official breaking it up and we got a clean break and now and now this time to the ropes and, and another clean break and now into the side headlock here and look at this like storm shoves him off and look at this. Oh, wow. Draws him into like a spine busting powerbomb there. Oh, look at this. Bit of a gator roll right into a cross face. Just wrenching on the back and neck of Mark Caliber. Caliber gets out of that one. They got an uppercut. And it's a big section in DDT. Tag man, and here comes Alex Caliber. Oh, wow. Look at that. And the fans showing their, showing their love for Excalibur here. dog taking care of Lex Storm hammering away and a stomp to the midsection uppercut and one from Lex Storm and a sidewalk slam dragging him into his own corner there and he makes a tag to Mike Blood. Look at this. Over the top to the outside goes Alex. Both men 
Ryan now fighting on the outside. Oh, face first off the ring apron. Seven. Oh, went for a spinning heel kick, but Alex, look at this. Power bomb by the rabbit dog. And Alex getting fired up here. Oh, but he gets caught. Fall away slam. Avalanche by Mike Blood. Now, under the cover. Kicked out at one. to Lex Storm. Oh, oh look at this. Pump handle, fall away slam. Oh, what a shot. Right, right across the head of Mark Caliber. The Mark Caliber fighting back. A spinning back kick. Good uh, clothesline, take it down the big man. Now look at this. A triangle choke of sorts. Oh, Lex Thorne. He gets out of that one. Corner, so he gets out of it. I was flipping to the Excalibur corner. And oh, here we go. Setting up for the calibration. And there it is. Cover. Mike Blood breaks it up. Blood the cold stare. And now Alex setting up Lex Storm. Perhaps going for the rabid bomb. And there it is. Shoulders are down. But Mike Blood miss. And because of that, Excalibur gets the victory. A mis miscalculated move by Mike Blood, and as a result, it costed his team. And Excalibur advances to the finals. The winners of the match at 6 minutes and 32 seconds, Excalibur. The twin brothers of Mark and Alex are now one step closer in gaining a tag team championship opportunity. But now, ladies and gentlemen, moving on to the second semifinal matchup. I hope, uh, I hope they all got their stitches. Because 
I imagine this is going to be another brutal matchup here. No doubt that Primordial Explosion has the odds stacked against them, considering that they've just been through a... And the winner of this matchup will meet... We'll meet Excalibur in the finals. So who do you got? Place your bets. Who's going to meet Excalibur in the final? Coming down to the ring in the second semi-final match. Nick Nitro Glycerin and Wooga Booga. Primordial Explosion. And coming down to the ring, Chris Cage and Ryan Osborne. Osborne and Cage coming off the victory over Evident Hell. In the meantime, Robert Explosion Fended off against Ace Adams and Andy Price in a huge, in a huge 30 minute match, which they were victorious in, but I gotta imagine the fatigue factor has still gotta be setting in. Belly to belly suplex there. And Glycerin doing everything he can to try to make sure the match is ended quickly. I do believe that even they know even they know that they can't go on forever One. and Glycerin at the top rope here he jumps and well, Osborne saw it coming there Face first off the apron. Four. Once again, this is only a 10 count. This is an ordinary tag match. Six. Once again, they gotta return to the gotta return to the corners. Or sorry, return to the ring, excuse me. My apologies, I seem to be a little distracted. Well, there's 
drop to hold and an elbow drop across the back. But Nick Nitro this one with an elbow to the midsection. That puts Chris Cage's assault to a halt. Tag made, and here comes Booga Booga. And they return the favor. Cage just hammering away on Wigga Booga here. Oh, nice move over there by Wigga. We've been delayed, Wuga. Now look at this. Drops the elbow. Oh wow, what a close line. being just tossed. Oh man. And drops Wuga right on his head and neck. to go through and plus we still got the pyramid prison chamber
Oh, wow. I have no idea what Cage is doing, but that, that could cost him right there. Oh, down goes Bowtie again. Counter with an arm drag. Ruka Ruka now building momentum. Oh, deadlift, power bomb, sit up position. Come on, come on, bull tie, make the freaking count. it looks like and drops him on his side nine minutes have now expired in this matchup and tosses him back in but oh look at this now Nick Nitro Glycerin putting the boots to him right to the side of the head to his advantage and Ryan Osborne made sure that didn't happen. Oh, Nick Nitro Glycerin comes in off the tag and right to the chin lock. No doubt that both of these both of these tag teams want a shot at the tag titles. The winning team here in this tournament will get that opportunity. Now we, we have now surpassed the 10 minute mark here in this matchup. And, oh, wow. Tag made. Here comes Osborne. And you can tell the fatigue factor is starting to set in. Sent out to the apron. And oh, Wuga pushes Chris Cage off as he tried to go for a cheap shot. And Wuga Booga made him. Double kaboom kick. And now into the, into the cover. And no kick out. has got to be setting in now. Yeah. 
Jumping side slam. And no kick out by Nick Nitro Glycerin. Glycerin stays alive. But the end could be near. Hip toss there. Oh wow, top block. And drops the elbow. Cutter. Irish whip into the corner. But Osborne is able to get out of that one. Look at this. And Nick Nitro Glisson using him against him. Oh, Fireman's carry into the gut buster. but unfortunately Chris Cage was unable to respond this wow it is hot tag and here comes Chris Cage bicycle kick takes him down and busts and, and Glesser's been busted open once again Suplex by Cage after blocking Wuga's attempt. Now just hammering away. Now Chris Cage. Kick to the midsection. And suplex into a power bomb. Now, oh, Luga Luga catches Chris Cage there. Tag made. And he sent him up. Oh, wow. Oh, but. Chris Cage landed right in front of his tag team partner there. And that allowed Osborne to make the tag. elbow but it could not deliver so Osborne gave him one of his own this throws him into the corner belly to belly overhead now look at this nice but Glycerin rolls through tag made Elbow drop. Excuse me. Oop. And shots in the way. Oh, has him up. Spinning side slam. up for that neck break bomb. 
Down goes Ruga. But, but McKnight with Westwood, he's, he's ready to even count. Oh, but Ruga was able to kick out. Him up, but Lugas goes around to a clothesline. Now Luga Luga has him up. There it is. That just case place. Wow. The stage is now set. We started with eight tag teams. We are now down to two. The winners of the match at 17 minutes and 42 seconds. Prime or dial explode. As these two team and as the two teams will rest up, we will now go to the Pyramid Prison match. And it, and it will be for the Commonwealth Heavyweight Championship. The participants, Cowboy John. Blaze McCoy. Tag Team Champions, Frozen Rage. The other half of the Tag Team Champions, Wild Matt Outlaw. Making his debut, the self-proclaimed King of the Streets. Mark Blade. Welcome Sir Dragon. Now, as this match loads up, the rules. The rules are as follows. The first four men will enter the, their pods, while the last two to enter will start the match in the ring. From there, every two minutes, a pod door will open, releasing that competitor into the match. This will continue until all four have been released. Her within the pyramid prison, via pinfall or submission. Once that happens, the, the, the last man will be current of heavyweight champion. So who do you got? Place your bets. Which of these six are you going with? Blade, Frozen Rage, John, Blaze McCoy, and Certain. Now we will say, on the next show, we will have, finally, the match to determine the inaugural Hardcore Champion. It will be Mark Caliber, Paul Utaker. The two men uh, competed in the Hardcore Scramble, which won one tie between the two will meet uh, sometime this month on the next show. Now, of course, in this match, the luck of the draw is very, very important. Of course, you don't want to be starting this matchup. You want to be starting in a pot. Everybody has already competed in Commonwealth with the exception of Mark Blade. And can you imagine Mark Blade making his debut in the Pyramid Prison for the championship and then he comes out victorious? Testing. And there is the Pyramid Prison.
Introducing one of the participants first from North Falls, South Dakota, one half of the Commonwealth Tag Team Champions, Wild Matt Outlaw. That outlaw and Frozen Rage will defend the Tag Team Championships Tag Team Tournament. But, they, but now they have the opportunity to capture the Heavyweight Championship. And now Matt Outlaw getting into the first pod. One down, three more to go. for the champion from Barnwell, South Carolina. He is the Commonwealth Heavyweight Champion, Cowboy John. For the champion here, he does not have to start this match. He will be starting in a pod just like the first four competitors to make their entrance. And that right there, that's what it's all about here today. The Commonwealth Championship. Now he's Cowboy John going into the second pod. Two pods loaded, two pods yet to be loaded. Coming down to the ring next. From Vancouver, British Columbia. Sir Dragon. Sir Dragon taking the third pod. <laughs> Introducing next from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. The lunatic hit from the sticks. The Steel City Superman. Your boy, Blaze McCoy. McCoy will be taking the final pod. And here comes the first competitor. One of the two that will be starting this match. From the coldest, darkest depths of his black soul.
He is one half of the Commonwealth Tag Team Champions. He is Frozen Rage. down to the ring making his debut he is the king of the streets Mark Blade Taking his sweet time getting to the chamber. He puts his scepter down and enters the chamber. And here we go. The Pyramid Prison is now underway. Pump handle drop by Mark Blade. Once again, making his debut here today. Look at this now, Frozen Rage. Happens in the Hammerlock suplex there. Now once again, it'll be every two minutes will be released from their pods. Irish whip. Forearm shot. Oof. after his partner, every man for himself. I'm sure they had a little bit of a talk in the back before this match began. And, oh, shoulder first into the post. And Mark Blade now putting, putting the right to the throat. And, oh! 
face buster there. And recover, kick out a two. Suplex to Mark Blade. That's right for his partner again. Once again, every man for himself. Only one man's gonna win this match of tonight and leave with the, with the with the biggest title here in the company. Right, look at this using the ropes against Rage. But, oh Meteora by Mark Blade. Now look at this. Boy. First way. Bit of a flat. And the countdown is on again. Let's see who will be number four as Outlaw goes for the cover. It's Sir Dragon. Belly overhead. And Sir Dragon tosses Mark Blade into the cage. And the prison now being used as a weapon. The cover and no kick out of two. The power bomb by Frozen Rage. And Mark Play tossed back in the hard way. We'll drop to a hold and outlaw gets into the second rope and Frozen Rage returns the favor. Losing their semi-final matchup. It looks like he's got to take out his frustrations on these competitors in this Pyramid Prison match. Oh, the Outlaw. Highway to hell. There's a cover. And Frozen Rage kicks out. Elbow shot by Sir Dragon. And we got a cover on the outside. As Outlaw goes to the top rope and... And Mark Blade is hitted. Five minutes and 34 seconds for the first elimination. Outlaw jumping from the top of the screw. Sent time by Sir Dragon. Sir Dragon, ooh, cross body. Bumping into both. Outlaw with a big boot. Taking down both competitors, and here's number five. It's the Commonwealth Heavyweight Outboy John. Here's a fixed slam by Sir Dragon as the champion now comes in. Suplex by Cowboy John. He realizes that this may be the biggest challenge to date, having to defend his title against five other competitors. He falls in rage, able to kick out. Now, by this time, you can't really win the match right now, but you can certainly lose the match right now. And if that happens to Cowboy, then Tom will be eliminated, and we will be guaranteed to have a new Commonwealth Heavyweight Champion. Oh, wow. Now, a power back outside. DDT by Sir Dragon on Frozen Rage. We're now less than 60 seconds away from Blaze McCoy making his presence. And Pebble and Rage able to kick out. Meantime, Cowboy John hammering away at Matt Outlaw. As a cover kick out at one. Mind Frozen Rage match the longest. He's the one that started this match along with Mark Blade. Cowboy John scaling to the top of the chamber for a cross body splash, but I don't think he got all of it. And here comes the Steel City Superman.
this power bomb on Blaze McCoy as he just came in. Oh, that must have, that would have been humiliating right there for Blaze McCoy to be eliminated to be eliminated this quickly. Well, this is it. All six men have entered now. And we are down to these five. Power bomb by Sir Dragon. Reversal onto the Boston Crab. Lariat to the back of Matt Outlaw. And a Lupez press. Boys and Rage trying to survive the submission, and he does. And we got a pinfall attempt here. And Matt Outlaw, the second man eliminated. Eight minutes and 58 seconds for the second elimination. And Cowboy John takes out Frozen Rage. Nine minutes and seven seconds for that elimination. Cowboy John takes out both tag team champions. We are down to three. Oof, right hand to Blaze McCoy. Fights out of it. Oh, nice. Nice suplex there by Sir Dragon. Front slam. Oh, drop kick by the by the Steel City Superman. Now Blaze McCoy looks to eliminate Sir Dragon from the matchup. So Dragon countered. John retaliates. This crucifix pin, pinning attempt. And only a one count. So Dragon takes down Blaze McCoy. And Blaze McCoy makes him pay with a clothesline. And now Cowboy John hammering away on the back of Boy. Boy came up short. And becoming a three-time champion in a Hell in a Cell match with Cowboy John. But now he has the opportunity to take the title from him again. Rolling Thunder by Sir Dragon into the cover. A kick out at two. Kick to the back. Oh, yes, Fireman's Perry into the burner. The burner by Blaze McCoy. Into the cover, Sir Dragon kicks out. Oh, look at this. Going for the hook. Line and sinker. Line and sinker. Into the cover. Hooks the leg. And Sir Dragon kicks out. And Cowboy takes down Blaze. A glancing blow with the clothesline. Lufes press to follow. There's a stomp to the arm. And a stomp to the other arm. Oh, right hand. Oh, all screws. Cowboy kick into the cover. Cowboy John eliminates Sir Dragon. 12 minutes and 16 seconds for the fourth elimination. We are down to two. And Blaze McCoy is busted open. Right on the head of Cowboy John. Keep in mind, keep in mind ladies and gentlemen, came in at number five. Blaze McCoy is the last man. So far, that means he is he is two minutes fresher than John. But nonetheless, anything could happen. He just hit nothing but the support beam. 
with his own fist. And that is all metal. again. Well, there's really nothing I can do about it. Off for the kick again. The cover. And Cowboy John retains the championship. My goodness. Outstanding performance by Cowboy John, getting four wins out of five. Certainly a force to be reckoned with. Blaze McCoy has got nothing to be ashamed of. to be ashamed of. Really nothing to be proud of. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner of the match at 14 minutes and one second. And still, the Commonwealth Heavyweight Champion, Cowboy John. Plays McCoy feet, but raises the arm of Cowboy John, his friend, out of respect. Plays McCoy, sore lose, Cowboy John. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, we now return to the tournament. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, my gosh. Blaze. Blaze McCoy. What the heck? Blaze McCoy just took Cowboy John up on his shoulders. And he just hit another burner on, on the chin. Okay, forget what I, what I said about him not being a sore loser. Cowboy Cowboy John taken out by Blaze McCoy. Blaze McCoy showing his true colors today, turning after failing to capture the title yet again. My goodness. Tell you what has just started between Blaze McCoy and Cowboy John. Blaze McCoy turning his back on John. And possibly he has also turned his back on the Commonwealth fans. My goodness. Well, ladies and gentlemen, as we try to get everything resituated, it is time for the finals of the tag team tournament. Excalibur and Primordial Explosion to face off in the finals. The winners will face Matt Outlaw and Frozen Rage. Wait a minute. Blaze McCoy, he stops the... Oh, and he gives the finger to the fans and Cowboy as well. He says sorry. That Oh, now he's laughing. Line and Sinka, see you soon, champ, he says. Much we just witnessed out of Blaze McCoy. Blaze McCoy is true colors. And now, gentlemen, coming down to the ring in the finals of the tag team tournament. Here is X Caliber. X Caliber yeah. defeating Vic. 
Victor Goldman and the Bastage. And then the Forgotten Billion Boy to get to the finals. In the meantime, here's a team that went through hell. And knocking off Ace Adams and Andy Price in 30 minutes. And then having to go through Ryan Oss Cage. I'll tell you, two teams are now well rested. Now they're getting set to find out who will be the new number one contenders. And here we go. I'll tell you what, these two tag teams here, these are two teams that know each other very, very well. With a clean break here. Into the ropes once more, and and, and another cool. Oh, look. Nick Nitro Glycerin delivering the first blow. Mark misses with a kick. And I will say, ladies and gentlemen, that Blaze McCoy is now going live. LTD Wrestling. Anyway, uh, actually, this uh, this might be released uh, on an earlier date, but but uh, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Blaze McCoy going live at 5 p.m. And here we go. Mark and Nick still going at an inverted angle slam. And Mark makes the tag to Alex. Alex looking to fire up the fans here. And here we go. That's what I'm oh. Going up first in the corner. And Alex returns the favor. And that. What a blow there. Now Alex Caliber. Seizing the momentum for the time being. Look at this big slam there by the, by the rabbit dog. And tossing him across the ring. He has him up. Inverted atomic drop. And uh-oh. Here we go. Oh, look at this. Up handle slam. The kaboom kick. And into the cover. And no kick out. Tag made in here. Comes Wooga Booga. Booga now in. Back suplex. And follows it up with a second one. Yeah. Uses a German suplex this time. And a 
has him out. The rabbit bomb coming up. He nails him. And they're kicked out at two. And Alex makes the tag to Mark. Shoulder tackle. And Mark Caliber. Looking for butterfly suplex. Nicely done. Caliber looking to get back into it. Mongolian chop misses. I refer it to the corner. Tag made. This drop to a hole by Nick, Nick Nigel. Elbow drop by Ruga Buga. Set out power bomb by Ruga Buga. Oh, look at this. Caliber going for the eternal rest, but Ruga Buga reverses. A brilliant counter. A brilliant counter there by Ruga Buga. Oh, a headbutt. Right to the face of Caliber. Swinging neck breaker. Look at this power bomb. The shoulders are down. And now Excalibur breaks it up. And now Nick Nigel Glycerin looks to make him pay with a power bomb. It's not there by Booga Booga. And a knee right to the, to the back of Mark. So far, Primal Dial Explosion doing very well here. There's leg drop across the arm. Getting back into it now. And leaping clothesline. Inverted atomic drop. And leg drop into the midsection. Drop kick to the face. Oh, Caliber now going to the top rope. Look at perhaps looking for death from above. There it is. the cover. Nick Nitro just went breaks it up. Now Mark Caliber going for the eternal rest once more. And this time he connects. Messed that one up there, and Glycerin got dropped right on his head. It's, it's already been stitched up twice. Caliber into the fireman's carry. There's the GTS. And there's the penalty kick to follow. Get the momentum back on his side. Close line. Another close line. Ducks a close line. And a leaping close line. Oh, 
Davis. Depths of despair by Callum. Uh, Uba busted once again. This might be the second time tonight. Turned by Caliber. Now Mark Caliber. Look at the rest. There it is. Oh, Wuga. Wuga, Wuga, no doubt, is fatigued. But he's still determined to gain the victory as he continues to fight back. Ten and a half minutes have already expired. And now Wuga, Wuga going for the caveman clutch. He's got it locked in. And the caliber, the ever resilient one, is able to break the caveman clutch. And he brings him to his corner. Bag made. And uh oh. The electric chair. And Alex right into the bulldog. This has been. And into the cover and a kick out by Wuga Buga and Alex Caliber firing up here. And so far, Nick Nitro Glycerin has yet to get back into this matchup. Uh oh, now Alex. He's going to be looking for that pounce. And there it is. Now it tosses him back into the Excalibur corner. And now they're looking to put, a, put some stomping into Ruga Buga. Glesman takes out the referee. And Caliber looking to finish off Glesman. Oh, look out. Depths of despair. Now the move is to move momentarily. It's going for the takes. Now going to the top rope. And oh, index splash. There goes the internet. Technical difficulties again. Meantime, Caliber punishing, punishing Wooga Booga here, and now going once, once to the once more to the top rope. And death from above. Hooks the leg. And that's it. Excalibur gets the victory. Holy smokes. Credit to both of these teams after accomplishing what they wanted to do and get to the finals. Take nothing away from Primordial Explosion, but nonetheless, your winners of the match at 14 minutes and 2 seconds, X Caliber.
My goodness, what a matchup there. And well, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be it for today. Uh, again, apologize, apologies for the lag. Apologies for the skips. Apologies for the split episodes. But I still hope you enjoyed it nonetheless. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you all in the next one. Please stay tuned.